Northern Siberia, inside the Arctic Circle. Temperatures here can drop to nearly minus 70 in winter. It's hard to find a colder inhabited place on Earth. This is Alumyok. This remote region is home to the Evenki, an isolated people who live much like their ancestors, the first Siberians. And they have the distinctive features of East Asia, the mark of a lost past they share with the Chinese. Today is a special day. The scattered nomads of this area meet up once a year to celebrate something that has been sacred for over 40,000 years, the reindeer. It seems incredible that early humans could have survived in this harsh climate. As the archeological record is so sparse, perhaps the best evidence for solving this mystery can be found in the way their descendants, the Evenki, live now. Piers Vitebsky has spent much of his life studying the culture of small tribes, from India to northern Siberia. The way humans were able to survive here was to make themselves as much like animals as possible. So they saw that the animals were in these furs and that they could move around even in the depth of winter. So we had to become the animals fill, pour ourselves into the shape of animals, if you like. Each fur has its own property. For example, there are different kinds of animals' furs that seal the cuffs and collars to stop ice crystals building up in your face. But for the main part of the body, reindeer fur is by far the warmest. Because every hair of a reindeer is hollow. It has a different internal structure from the fur of any other animal. And so it actually retains more heat than any other fur. Learning to adapt to this climate couldn't have been more challenging for a species which began its existence in the tropics. <laughs> 